The Sierra Nevada Corporation, or SNC, plans to integrate variants of the very capable and combat-proven AGM-158 Joint Air-to-Surface Standoff Missile Series of stealthy cruise missiles onto its MC-145B Wiley Coyote armed light transport aircraft. The company says that the ability to deploy these weapons via the aircraft's rear cargo ramp will enable them to contribute to operations during higher-end conflicts, as well as support responses to lower-tier contingencies. U.S. Special Operations Command is presently testing an MC-145B prototype, among other types, as part of its armed Overwatch program, as a potential replacement for the U-28A Draco aircraft, which will be primarily expected to operate in permissive environments. SNC highlighted the planned Joint Air-to-Surface Standoff Missile JASSM, capability for the MC-145B in a recent press release and accompanying video. No mention was made of any plans to integrate this stealthy cruise missile. The aircraft itself is derived from the Polish-designed M28 Skytruck twin-engine turboprop-like utility aircraft, an unarmed version of which, the C-145A Combat Coyote, U.S. Air Force Special Operations Command, AFSOC, already operates. We can actually do palletized munitions, Mark Williams, SNC's Vice President of Aviation Strategic Plans and Programs, says in the recently released video. We're going to be the only ones, in the armed Overwatch competition, who can actually fire a JASSM out of the cargo bay. SNC has not said what variant or variants of the JASSM series it is planning to integrate onto the MC-145B. The US Air Force presently has two versions of the AGM-158 in inventory, the standard type with a range of around 230 miles, and an extended range 1, or JASSMER, which can hit targets out to around 600 miles. Both of these are intended for use against targets on land. The US Air Force and the US Navy have also fielded an anti-ship derivative, the AGM-158C long-range anti-ship missile, and the latter service is now pursuing a variant that will be a hybrid of sorts between the JASSMER and the long-range anti-ship missile. An Extreme Range Version, or JASSMXR, is also under development and is expected to be able to strike threats more than 1,000 miles away. It's also not clear how many of these missiles SNC expects that an MC-145B will be able to carry at once. Concept art that the company has released so far shows a single missile in the plane's main cargo bay. However, the weapon is depicted sitting between the two rows of four common launch tubes that the Wiley Coyote can also be configured to carry. Each one of these tubes can be used to launch a variety of precision-guided munitions, as well as small drones. The aircraft also has four underwing hardpoints for additional stores. We've got the ability to shoot anywhere from 14 to 28 APKWS, Advanced Precision Kill Weapon System 70mm laser-guided rockets. We also have the ability to shoot Hellfires, as well, SNC's Williams explained in the promotional video. We can drop a small diameter bomb. We have eight reloadable common launch tubes in the cargo bay. You can launch a bunch of precision-guided munitions. You can launch unmanned aerial vehicles out of those common launch tubes. The MC-145B is also designed to be able to accommodate a variety of different communications, data sharing, and sensor packages. This includes provisions for sensor turrets with electro-optical and infrared cameras, as well as laser designators, under the nose and in a retractable position under the fuselage. The aircraft will also be able to carry pod systems, such as the NSP-7 radar, which has synthetic aperture imaging and moving targeting indicator functionality. When it comes to planned munition options, the JASSM is in a completely different category from the weapons that the other aircraft competing in U.S. Special Operations Command's SOCOM, armed overwatch fly-off, are capable of employing. In the promotional video, SNC's Williams made clear that the point of integrating this cruise missile onto the aircraft was so that it could actually have an impact in the peer-to-peer -peer fight, as well as support lower-end operations.
The marketing material SNC had previously released also mentioned the possibility of the MC-145B being able to deploy versions of the ADM-160 miniature air-launched decoy, as well as X-61A unmanned aircraft, via the rear ramp. The ADM-160 is, in many ways, a small cruise missile that carries an electronic warfare payload, which can jam or otherwise confuse enemy radars, depending on the version, instead of a traditional warhead. The X-61A is an experimental drone under development as part of the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency's DARPA, Gremlins program that is capable of operating as part of a networked swarm and that is designed to be air-launched and recovered in mid-air by a mothership aircraft. The Wiley Coyote can also do other missions that aren't even captured in the armed overwatch requirements, Williams, SNC's Vice President of Aviation Strategic Plans and Programs. The company has also been focusing heavily on other multi-mission capabilities that the MC-145B offers, including its ability to airdrop cargo and act as a casualty evacuation platform, compared to the other armed overwatch entrants, all of which are smaller, single-engine designs. SNC, which is also supplying A-29B Super Tucano light attack aircraft to the Air Force in cooperation with Brazil's Embraer, said that it looked at 44 different aircraft before ultimately settling on a converted M-28 Skytruck for its armed overwatch submission. SNC is certainly touting the potential for the MC-145B to provide an additional layer of flexibility and capacity in these kinds of scenarios. However, the aircraft's value in this role could be limited by how many JASSM, or other similarly large stores, it can carry at once and how readily it may be able to employ them, even in coordination with other assets providing the targeting information. It will certainly be interesting to see whether or not the MC-145Bs ultimately has a future as a cruise missile slinging platform in addition to its other capabilities.